Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Violet. So, in between videos, I went and did a singular, quick, like, raid den, and I got some XP candies that we're going to use on Crocs to get him to level up, and that way he will evolve, but I didn't want to do that in between videos, so... Um, there may come a time where I find another Pokemon to replace Buttons with, but in the meantime, I think we'll keep him. Uh, but yeah, here we go. Big boy's growing up. Look at that little face. Look at that little face. I, I just, I love Crocolore and the whole line, actually. I've said that a thousand times, but I really do. So, we're gonna give one of these candies to Buns here and let him level up. Sure. Bite, that'll be a good move to have. And like I said, there's another fairy type in the game that I used in my very first ever playthrough of this game that I might swap Doc Bun out with when the time comes. I don't know, we'll have to see how all of that goes. So I'm gonna find one of these raid dens and I'm gonna show it to you. So that way you guys kinda know what to expect with those. Again, those of you that are new to the game and have never actually played it before, we'll go find one real quick to kind of show you all what that's all about. If, if I can get over to this one, this one may re this one may require a ability that I don't have yet. That would be the ability to fly or to jump this ledge. I don't know that I could do that. Oh, well, that stinks. There's one right there. Landscaping down there. I forgot how like almost painful it is to like traverse this game without all of Maridon's abilities. Alright, we've got this trainer we can fight real quick, so let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so, um, uh, let me look on the map and see if there's any uh, other dens that are going to allow me to work with the terrain that I have. This poison type den may be the way to go, but if not, I can show you guys how all of that's done in a, like a different, uh, different episode when we have a bit more way to traverse the landscape here, but let's go ahead since I can't find a raid den, because I'm pretty sure that one I marked is the one that's up there. Um, we'll go ahead and take on the first gym. So in these games, the gyms are done a little differently. You've got the gym, and then you've got like a puzzle you have to do. So you're out to earn some gym badges and take on the Pokemon League, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I knew it. I'm so glad I asked you to do it. Before you can battle the gym leader, you gotta pass a certain test challenge set by them. I can't read, apparently. Their gym test, which is the same in every other game. Every gym's test is different. If you ask the lobby staff about it, they'll tell you what's up. Here, have these. You can use them. Consider me healing up your Pokemon. Oh, bet. Thanks, Nimona. Appreciate you, pal. I'm so glad you're aiming to be a champion, too. This is the best news ever. Man, I'm so excited. I can barely stand still. I can see that. Guess I'll go battle every trainer I run into. 
she kills me. But anyway, like what I was saying, every gym in the Pokemon games has puzzles, but these are like, they're different than like your normal gym puzzles. I don't, there's like certain things you have to do, certain actions and all that kind of stuff, like the olive roll, for example, and I'm very, very bad at this. All right, so. And I think it was Sword and Shield that actually implemented the different um, different ways of all of that happening, I think, anyway. I just, I love the music in this game. I will say it a thousand times. Uh, I think Gen 5 still probably has the best, like, I never noticed that before. The Pokeballs, I honestly never noticed that on the ground before. Here is the olive roll thingy. Welcome to the olive rolling field. This gym test is all about stamina. You'll need to push with all you've got to get a large olive ball rolling and make it all the way to the end. Get the ball over various obstacles and then push it into the goal to clear the course. I am ready to start the gym test. Let's, let's do it. All right, so I kind of wish that Candy wouldn't have leveled up my starter as high as it did. I did not know it was gonna do it that high, but I still think it'll all be okay. Okay. I mean, worst case, I can just use like Cheeto or something, or my uh, Fido. All right, so we're gonna push this awkward shaped olive ball thing into the goal. This is actually harder to do with the Joy-Cons than it is to do with the Pro Controller that I'm, I'm using. And, well, come on. As I say that as I struggle to do it. Oof. And these battles I will not speed up in the gyms because they're kind of important. They're not just random trainer battles. But I'm still playing with my editing software, so you might see some things change in the intro and all that kind of stuff as I get better at doing it. It's just, it's been so long since I've had to seriously edit a video that it's all starting to come back to me. That and I'm using a different program than the one I used when I made walkthroughs before. Pikachu! Dolly, 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 whoop! It's about dog fussing in the background. There's kids playing outside and they're not playing with her and she simply won't have that, so. Uh, Play Rough is a very good fairy type attack. Gym Trainer Esmeralda. I could probably try to get that thing over the, the, um, what's it called? Oh, there we go. I think we'll just take it this way. this thing over this hill. Oh, come on. There we go. Got it. Um, yeah, I'll just fight this guy real quick. It's not going to take very long. Which is weird because small of isn't even a bug type, so why it's featured in the bug type gym, I don't know. That's a uh, fantastic question. And if you guys want, I can make an in-depth raid guide with some of the different raid Pokemon I've built on my, my main Violet file. Kind of show you how the raids and that kind of stuff work, since I don't really have anything good in the walkthrough file yet to be able to do that. And I can't transfer Pokemon from home because it's on a different account. And I've heard that that's a, that's a nightmare to try to fix, so... 
Your mighty will blew right past me after all. Yeah, that it did. And I've got a straight shot to that goal once he gets himself out of the way. Let's go. All right, here we go. The noise this thing makes makes me uncomfortable, I'm not gonna lie. Hey, I got it, let's go. I, I take different um, screenshots and stuff for possible like video stills or uh, thumbnails. Alrighty. With that performance, I'm sure we look forward to a great olive harvest next year. I'm happy to declare your gym test officially cleared. Congratulations. Please report your result to the lobby staffer at the gym and good luck in your battle against Kate. Let me see if this is if this is not the the raid den that's all the way up here because I'm afraid that it is. And if it is, then I'm not gonna be able to show it to you. Yeah, it is. That stinks. That's okay. We'll just go back to Cortando and um, I, I think we fought all the trainers. I think. can head back down here and then we will take on Katie in the next episode because I, I kind of want to devote each episode to one specific thing um, oh there's a den over here is this that same fighting type one that's across the way is it it is. It stinks. I can't, I can't get over there at the moment to get to it. It would just have me land in the water. But um, that's what kind of makes this so difficult. It's like there's no like easy way to like do the raid dens because you have to have your ride Pokemon to like traverse the terrain, which kind of makes it difficult. But anyway, I tried and... I should have shown the one that I did to just, it was a level 20 Bramblin. Like I should have probably have just shown that one, but it didn't even occur to me, honestly. So with that being said, we do have one final thing to do here. And that is to report this to the gym trainer. And then we will get our first gym badge. So that's exciting. We are ready to challenge the gym leader, which we will do in the next episode. So I hope you guys be well. I hope you guys are well. Stay kind to one another. And I will see you guys in the next part.